Hey guys, Matt here. I haven't given you an update since I got back from the mountain through video. And I know you guys have been asking me a lot about a specific part of the uh, trike and whether it's arrived. Well, here it is. This is basically my ride for the whole tour. The components have all kind of come together. I got my drone box, I got my panniers, I've got all the who's it's and what's it's and doodads, and then I've got the trailer. I spent the, the last few days uh, getting acquainted with it, uh, putting it together, getting the tires and everything, and right now I'm working on electrical. The trailer itself is awesome. Um, it's got a lot of room inside. Uh, I can fit my Arhu actually on the inside, which was something I really wanted to do. My Arhu is that musical instrument. I don't know if you've seen it, but I wasn't able to take this on the trip um, before, but looks like now I'll be able to. Um, it's got uh, actually an extra flag mount that he gave me, strap tie downs on the top, uh, disc brakes that are hydraulic that go up to the uh, front end of the trike. I've got uh, wheel fenders to keep that, uh, that mud down. And then I've got a really amazing situation here. The, uh, the attachment system to the back of the trike is really, really good. It fits on my trike by two Weber hitches that are supported on the frame on both sides of the axle. And it allows for a fairly tight turning radius. The uh, trunk itself is locking, which, uh, which adds a lot of security. Not to mention that the Weber hitch itself is locking, uh, which is great. It's got a shock and strut system uh, that will uh, absorb a lot of that road, uh, road wear that I had before. So I think this trailer with its craftsmanship and its price tag will last me as long as I need it to. It is like a train though. <laughs> with the hitch system and the length of the trunk, uh, it, is a, uh, it is a long setup. Okay, now to answer another one of those questions, when am I gonna set off? When am I gonna go on this trip? Well, um, some things have happened. Uh, my friend in Japan had some troubles uh, that I was supposed to ride with on the beginning part of my journey. Um, so I am gonna go to Japan and help him out for a little while. He takes priority uh, right now. Uh, when I get back from Japan, um, some interesting things have happened and they just started to happen so I don't wanna jinx it but uh, I have an opportunity to go and take this whole thing to the next level with regards to television. Uh, I met a producer uh, manager of traveling um, shows. Basically, he can take a, a, a premise and create a show around it and he knows the ways in which to promote it to the world. And uh, he approached me, we kind of, uh, came together and he thinks that uh, he would like to take a stab at joining the Jio team and creating an element that would back me up as I travel around the world. It's a big deal. Uh, but he said that in order to do this properly, he needs me to postpone my start date. I think I'm gonna take him up on his offer and see where it goes. That means that I will probably have to postpone start uh, for about three months until October. It's not something I wanna do. It puts me into uh, a new season uh, where things are starting to get cold and it might eliminate a couple of countries like South Korea and possibly Japan, depending on how cold it is. But uh, I think that the potential of waiting and doing this right and having a potential network TV show on board and might legitimize the journey and professionalize the journey and give me an opportunity to do even more things when I do get on the road. Granted, the trip isn't as raw, but the eventual goal of uh, the Jaya World Tour was to have something on television. And if I can do that now before I even get started on the second phase here, let's just say, then, uh, then that's great. So I'm all set with regards to the trike and with regards to um, all my equipment and gear, now I can focus on the back end and the framework and the structure of the trip. So 
Um, that's your update. It's a big one. The trailer, panniers, side bags, everything from T-Cycle, everything from everybody and HP and, and I do has all come together and uh, now it's just working on the back end and uh, wiring up some last minute details with the trailer. Jaiyo.